The Bundeswehr is moving forward with a significant upgrade to its reconnaissance fleet as part of the Spafarzeg Next Generation or Corsic project. The goal of this initiative is to equip the military intelligence forces with state-of-the-art reconnaissance vehicles, potentially replacing the aging Fennec vehicles currently in service. The vehicle selected for this project is based on the Piranha 6x6 platform, developed by General Dynamics European Land Systems, DELS. This decision followed a competitive bidding process, with the Piranha platform outperforming rivals such as Rainmetal's Fuchs Evolution and KNDS's Patria Cavs. The Bundeswehr plans to procure up to 252 vehicles, with an initial order of 92 units. However, final approval for the project remains contingent on the completion of an appeal period and parliamentary review of the 25 million euro proposal. If the timeline stays on track, the contract could be finalized by late 2024 or early 2025. Two prototypes are expected to be delivered by 2026, and the production of the remaining 90 units would occur over the following two years. The contract also includes an option to order an additional 162 vehicles. The selection of the Piranha platform signals the second Bundeswehr project involving the Piranha family, a well-established line of armored vehicles with a history of global use. The Piranha 6x6, though not yet publicly unveiled, is anticipated to be a modification of the larger 8x8 platform, tailored to the specific needs of the Corsic project. The amphibious capability is a key feature, although it might come at the cost of reduced armor protection. The platform is expected to comply with Stanag 4569 Level 2, providing mobility without compromising too much on protection. One of the distinguishing features of the Piranha 6x6 is its engine placement. Unlike traditional designs where the engine is at the rear, the Piranha positions the engine to the right of the driver. This layout optimizes the vehicle's roof space for mounting turrets and sensor systems, enabling a broader range of reconnaissance and combat capabilities. The Corsic will be equipped with the Rainmetal 25mm KBA automatic cannon, a high-performance weapon system capable of a firing rate of up to 600 rounds per minute. This cannon, integrated into a stabilized turret by Valhalla Turrets, was demonstrated at Eurosatory 2024 and provides both precision and versatility in combat scenarios. The weapon system offers variable firing modes, supporting a wide range of operational needs. The Piranha platform has a long history of service, dating back to the Piranha I6X6 model introduced in 1972. This version was initially used by the Swiss Army and later produced under license in Chile and Canada, where it became known as the AVGP and LAV-I. Over the years, various versions of the Piranha platform have been adapted for different military needs, including models fitted with specialized weapons like the IMI HVMS gun or TOW anti-tank missile systems. The latest iteration, Piranha V, introduced in the 2010s, offers robust protection against medium-caliber threats and can integrate a wide range of weapon systems. The Piranha V also features a modern electronic architecture and has been adopted by several countries, including Denmark, Romania, and Switzerland. The Corsic's primary role will be reconnaissance, relying on an advanced suite of optical, optronic, and acoustic sensors. Additionally, the vehicle will be equipped with electromagnetic spectrum reconnaissance tools, allowing it to gather critical information across various frequency bands. The vehicle's communication systems will enable teams to relay data and coordinate with command centers, ensuring effective intelligence sharing during missions. While the Corsic is not expected to feature anti-tank capabilities directly, portable weapons carried by the troops will fulfill this role. The Bundeswehr is also exploring the future use of loitering munitions as an additional tool in reconnaissance and combat missions. The Bundeswehr has outlined specific performance requirements for the Corsic vehicle, including a top road speed of 100 km h and a range of 1,100 km when traveling at a consistent speed of 60 km per hour. While amphibious capability is preferred, it is not mandatory. The silent mode feature, allowing for stealthier operations, remains flexible in terms of technology used. The Corsic project marks a major step forward in the modernization of the Bundeswehr's reconnaissance fleet. The selection of the Piranha 6x6 platform reflects the Bundeswehr's focus on versatility, mobility, and cutting-edge technology for its reconnaissance missions. If the project continues on schedule, the first prototypes will be in service by 2026, with full production rolling out over the following years. This development, along with other modernization efforts, underscores Germany's commitment to maintaining a strong and capable military force, ready to meet the challenges of modern warfare.